AMC's announcement of the Walking Dead spin-off shows before the flagship series ended caught showrunner Angela Kang off guard. The zombie franchise has been airing on AMC for 12 years, amassing many fans over the years. At its peak during the mid-2010s, The Walking Dead was the most popular cable television series airing at the time. While viewership has dwindled since then, the show has continued to provide plenty of interesting groups like The Commonwealth and characters like Lance Hornsby to keep dedicated viewers on the edge of their seats. Due to its success, The Walking Dead has spawned a number of spin-off series over the years. This includes the long-running Fear the Walking Dead, which began as a prequel series documenting the early days of the apocalypse on the West Coast, before focusing on characters like Morgan and White from the parent show. Shorter series include The Walking Dead. World Beyond, which heavily features the CRM, who took Rick Grimes prisoner in season 9 of the main series, and Tales of the Walking Dead, an anthology series about survivors in different locations and time periods. AMC has also announced that, after the final season of The Walking Dead ends, three spin-offs featuring characters from the flagship series will air in 2023. In an interview with Digital Spy, The Walking Dead showrunner Angela Kang says it was a surprise when AMC announced the spin-off shows before the parent series had ended. Kang explained this influenced the direction the show's last episodes are going to take. Check out what Kang had to say below. What's for the world of The Walking Dead? Kang's revelation indicates audiences may not have been expected to know the fates of any characters on The Walking Dead prior to the series finale. AMC's announcements confirm that many fan favorites are now safe from death on the series. This includes Daryl, whose Europe-based spin-off is currently in production, as well as Negan and Maggie, who are set to return in The Walking Dead. Dead City, this time fending off zombies in New York City. The Walking Dead's batch of new shows also includes a Michon and Rick Grimes spin-off, with Dan I. Guerrera and Andrew Lincoln set to reprise their roles after having left the series in earlier seasons. While viewers may find some relief knowing who will survive The Walking Dead's final episodes, the announcements take away much of the tension for popular characters whose fates are now set in stone. The series finale promises to be massive, with director Greg Nicotero confirming a Walker horde will appear. Despite this, the level of excitement may be subdued because audiences know certain characters are destined to make it off the show alive. Kang has teased that the spin-off announcements will impact season 11 part 3's story, which indicates the tension won't be entirely lost. Instead, it may be presented in compelling work arounds that still make The Walking Dead's final episodes a tense memorable experience. Source. Digital Spy.